This site used to treat, when we came, three litres a second through this old treatment plant here. The treatment plant we've put in behind me will treat 17 litres a second. So at 17 litres a second, it doesn't spill off, off the storm weir. So it, that's all the flow that's coming to this works goes through that plant. So there are two CSOs, combined sewer overflows associated with this, this plant. One at the top of the hill there, and one behind the, that timber railing. Those two have been resolved by the, the process we've put in here. We had that tank in, I think the first third of May, something like that, we came to visit site. By mid-July, that tank was in. We've put a proper stainless steel weir in it now. That gets to a certain point, the water falls over that, and it goes down another pipe and out into the river. You can see there's, there's uh, what they call bagging down here, so temporary pipe work will make that permanent. That kit behind us on higher. Now, some of it is a bit too small. So when we put the permanent plant in, we're going to upsize the bits that are a bit too small. And we only found that out by running it and seeing how it work. We could have spent three or four years designing it, and put, instead we've put it in, run it, the higher stuff can go back, we'll, put, we'll buy equipment to replace it. There'll be a, a number of things that we can modularise, and that makes it then, then doable. I am really chuffed that the team have done a cracking job. 